Welcome back fellow Gunners across the world. Watford 2, Arsenal 3, Match Report. Arsenal moved into the top four for the first time in two months as they held on to beat Watford 3-2 in Sunday's Premier League clash. With Wolves, West Ham and Manchester United falling to defeats at the weekend, the Gunners now have the biggest chance to reclaim a place in the elite competition of the European Champions League. Martin Odegaard literally got the ball rolling with a wonderfully worked opening goal that was quickly cancelled out with an excellent Cucho Hernandez equaliser. However, Bukayo Saka restored the lead with another outstanding strike. Mikel Arteta's side held on at the end as Musa Sissoku pulled one back after Gabriel Martinelli had given Arsenal a two-goal cushion. It's another crucial three points for the Gunners. So what did we learn from this result? Well, it seems Arsenal are finally becoming consistent. With eight wins from the last ten Premier League matches and four on the bounce, Arsenal are the side leading the charge for fourth place whilst their rivals crumble. That's very good news, especially as they have a three-game cushion over them. Not having to rely on those matches in hand is such a bonus. Arsenal are not winning matches by huge margins, but they have reached a level of consistency that is essential for the final run-in. They now have three matches in the next six days, starting with Leicester at home and then followed by Liverpool and Aston Villa. These matches are now bonus matches and any points gained from them, which we hope is nine, will see them secure fourth and even start challenging for third. Who would have thought that at the start of the season? Martin Odegaard and Bukayo Saka are just pure talent. They are showing genius timing on the ball and Arteta certainly has an eye for the right players. The display in the final third of the pitch was sublime. They tore their opponents to shreds. Having said that, it was not a perfect performance. There was an unwelcome amount of sloppiness at the back, which included Aaron Ramsdale, and the two goals conceded could have been more. The Gunners' keeper seems to have hit a bit of a rough patch. But the top four spot is now in Arsenal's hands. The job now is to maintain this level and the form they found, especially centrally and in the final third. They have to stay consistent and if they do, then European Champions League, elite football and all that comes with it is theirs to claim. Thank you for watching Arsenal Online. Please subscribe and ring the bell for all the latest Gunners news.